Okay, so let's talk how to draw rope. So the first thing I would do if I was working with a piece of rope would be to just draw it as if it were a tube. So getting these fine guidelines so that there's a, a thickness, like it's just a tube, um, to make sure that I have an even consistency, that it's you know the same width throughout. So I would sketch it in completely, you know, just as if it were a straight, solid, smooth tube. Okay, then to make this tube into rope, we're going to use a lot of S-curves. So kind of that type of a shape, like a really stretched out S. And so I'm going to go along this rope, and I'm going to make these evenly spaced S-curves. So now it's like um, still something that's smooth, but has a, like a wrapped stripe, like a candy cane or something. Um, so we need to work on the edges now to make it look like dimensional twisted rope. So now I'm going to connect these S curves with an extra curve. So it's just like a curve, like a C shape. And now that I'm breaking up this outside contour so that the outer contour isn't smooth, it has dimension, it now looks like those two pieces of um, rope twisted together to give us that, that twisted rope look. So that's really all there is to it for anything that's twisted. Twisted rope, twisted fabric, um, a unicorn horn, uh, whatever that may be. It's just these S-curves, really elongated S-curves connected with a, you know, like a C.